My name is Dakota Forrest. I'm, an, uh, I'm a specialist, fork time 160th. I've been riding for four years now. What we're learning today is how to properly corner, how to make a plan to go into a corner and how to adjust your plan as new obstacles arise as you see more into the corner. The reason why the military wants us to get into these courses more is mostly for safety of the soldiers. You're a big asset and they don't want anyone dying or just keep you from getting injured in general. And doing courses like this just broadens your, your knowledge. You know how to better assess the roads and it can keep you alive as well as other people alive. It's, it, it just makes you a more skilled and well-rounded rider. The way the military is investing into us to keep us more safe is they give these classes and they give you the time for them. They make them free so they, your unit will pay for it all. So there's really no excuse why you can't do it because your leadership will give you the time. You don't have to pay anything out of your pocket. And really it's just all about you taking initiative and saying you want to do this course, you want to do a course. No matter what it is, whether it's the advanced street skills, a sport bike riders course, basic riders course, anything like that, it's just doing it yourself. Going through what I've gone through now, through this last couple days of training in this course alone, I definitely think I can assess the roads better. I can see hazards more. Before I would see telephone poles and they're just telephone poles. Now those telephone poles can tell me if the road is turning or if there's possibly people who maybe live off to the side of the road. I thought I knew what I was doing as of a couple weeks ago, but this, this course really opens up your mind. It really makes you think outside the box and teaches you a lot more.